looking at male match sometimes the question comes as you see it here on the right hand side to create a data source so note that this is not the data source but it is the information given to you to create the data source that is why you see fields here and you see all the column headings appearing as a list under fields so what you have to do every time when you deal with a data source question compare the information to create a data source with the letter that you find in your question paper here we've got an example of a letter that has to be created but when you look at the data source the match fields that we see here on the letter those match fields are not appearing as the headings of this data source if we can call it a data source it is because this it is not a data source yet a data source is the one that we'll see on the right on the left hand side of the screen so it means the information to create the data source that we see on the left hand side comes from the information that we find here on the right hand side so when you find a data source like this you have to look at the letter and find out if the match fields are already on top of your table as column headings if they are not on top of the table as column headings then it means you have to create it looking at fields and counting how many column headings and all those column headings they will be created to be on top like what we see on the left hand side of the screen if you don't create it according to what you see on the left hand side of the screen it means when you go to insert match field under mailings you won't be able to see school name address 1 address 2 and address 3 and principal you will only see fields school 1 school 2 school 3 which is in go now going to be in a wrong format so the issue is creating a data source that will be able to work on your mail match now let's see let's say you have created a data source according to the correct structure that we see here now on the left then i'm going to open a document that i will use to create a letter so now this document that i've created here i've opened here I'm going to link it with the data source that we've created. So we go to mailings. We go to select recipients. Use existing list. Then I'm going to look for the data source where I've saved it. Once I found the data source, you will see that insert match field. When I click there where it's written insert match field, with an arrow pointing down, I click there, I will find all the things that are supposed to be part of my letter. Let me open the letter again on the example of a letter. Uh, the question or the instruction so if the instruction is like this and they want me to create a letter after the tap stop of 10 centimeter left according to this instruction then when i go to my document i'm going to set the tabs i click home paragraph group i launch the group and then you will see at the bottom there i have tabs then I'm going to set it to be 10 uh, you type it there where it says tap stop position and then you choose the alignment here so currently it's left then I click set then you will see it will be set and the 10 centimeter will be in that 
big portion that block and when I click OK you will see on the ruler there it's indicated indicated that there will be a tap stop on that measurement so I press tap on the keyboard then I can insert the match field so when we look at the instruction of the example of a letter we see that the first one is school name address 1 address 2 and address 3 so when I get there I'm going to go to mailings select insert match field school name then I press enter I press tap I go to insert mesh field address one enter tap insert mesh field address two enter tap insert mesh field address three so when I press enter enter then I can type dear so I know here it should be the principal then I go to insert mesh field principal so the match fields can be changed to be bold and you can even edit them according to the instructions. So I'm going to make these match fields bold. All the match fields bold. Enter. Then I will write the letter as it appeared on my question paper or the instruction that I was given to create this letter. So after creating a letter, you have to either print this or save it for the instructions. So if I want to preview the real results, I will go to mailings. I will go to the end where it says finish and match, edit individual documents. Then when it says all, I click OK. You will see now I will have the address here all the addresses and then if I go scroll down to page 2 I will have all the information that I had to insert appearing throughout all the pages as expected so this is a matched document okay thank you very much I hope you understand the difference between creating a data source the main issue here was to create a data source in a way that it will be read according to what you see in the letter the letter demonstrates match fields and those match fields when you create the data source should always be on top thank you please click subscribe on the page and click the bell to get notifications on new videos enjoy